Today we have something really cool to show. It's something that was sent to us to review, but something we can definitely use. It is the H Calorie car refrigerator slash cooler. It's electric and Steve's going to unbox it. But this is the user manual, which we will get a little more into later. Now here is the top view of the cooler slash refrigerator. It opens long ways, which is a little different from most cooler refrigerator setups. The power button, temperature controls, and settings button as well as the latch on the other side and inside you'll see it comes with another cord for your DC plug and a drain to let out condensation that might form along with the wall plug you get a DC cord and plug to use it in your car because it's meant to be a car or an RV fridge when you're traveling but we are actually going to use it plugged into the wall shows you the parts in the booklet here and how to connect the two different power supplies and this is the one we're going to be doing now okay so I have the power box here and then I need to connect the AC cord to that once I get those connected I have to plug this into the cooler and then we're going to plug it into the wall here is where I connect the AC plug-in and you'll notice next to it is a USB plug. The USB port that I saw down there where you plug this into the refrigerator, it can be used to charge your phones or small devices, tablets and stuff like that. So that just gives you an extra outlet to use for a charging port. Power might have to hold it. There we go. This is what it is reading right now at 77 degrees. Notice it has a handy light for nighttime. And this little section is for refrigerated foods like uh, fresh vegetables or fruit. The larger capacity is for your main foods, refrigerated or freezer items, depending on how you have your temperature set. This has a sort of a latch string here so it doesn't fly backwards the lid, kind of like a cooler. These are some handles. This is the latch. You can hear it latch. You have to pull firmly for it to come open. This is the part of the manual that tells you how to control your temperature settings. It's super simple. It has an on power button, up and down, and settings button. About three minutes and it's already dropped two degrees. So we know it's working and it's only pulling 14 point four volts. About five more minutes and it's down to 71 degrees. I have not messed with the temperature adjustments at all or pressed the settings button. I also noticed that it says here number six is the frozen area, number five is the refrigeration. Well number six is pointing to the bigger area and number five is showing the refrigerator area. Whenever I get it down to temp and put foods in it, then I can see how it works. It has been probably 10 minutes at the most, and it's already down to 39. I believe it only takes about 20 minutes to get down to temp. I'm going to go get some refrigerated items and some drinks, maybe some um, cans, and put them in here overnight to get nice and cold. Down to 35, because I set it on 35. I loaded it up with a few things. These are some meat sticks and some cans of cola, some fresh fruit, fresh foods over here, macaron pops. Let those chill overnight because it's bedtime. Seems to be a really nice refrigerator to have, especially if you're going on a trip and say if you're going shopping, we do Costco and Sam's and we have a cooler bag, but it doesn't seem to fit most of the stuff. It fits a small amount of stuff because everything's packed in bulk. So this might help when we do our out of town warehouse food shopping. 
The only issue that I've noticed so far is this little strap is hanging out. You just have to push it in before closing. Not a big deal. Once I add the cans and the food and stuff, it's gone back up to 48. I have it set for 35. It should be going down to about 35. It's the next day. It says 35, which is what it's set at. I have some, oh, it's nice and cool. Perfect. Yeah, everything is nice and cool. In conclusion, the H calorie car refrigerator can be used just as that, or it can be lowered to be a freezer as well. Thank you for watching, and you'll find the link to order below.